Hello, um, so I'm walking down, oh my goodness, a section of the Worth Way, which I've never been down before. Um, it's pretty good. Uh, let me just see, you've got, um, it's quite muddy, and um, there's a nice bridge coming on ahead uh, just down there. Um, I'll be getting to that in just a moment. Um, but I've been walked around Quarrelly quite a lot quite sunny sorry about the uh, the lighting um, maybe if I uh, there you go, if I hold it that side um, but yeah it's quite a nice little section very very muddy as you can uh, see along there um, I thought I'd give it a go see what I could find going off the beaten path is always best um, I'm just looking forward to getting to this uh, bridge which is just ahead here. I'm not too sure yet whether it's a, a railway bridge uh, or just a, a vehicle bridge. But from down here, it looks gorgeous. Um, I'm a sucker for an old bridge or a nice tower. Yeah, that's a gorgeous bridge. Loving that. Let's go in there. Let's walk underneath and have a look, see if we can see anything. This is all brand new, never been here before. Let's see what there is. This little mini tunnel, just under there. Traffic cone, obviously, they're taking over the world. <coughs> um, okay. Got some graffiti, fest, um, bridge fest, I guess. And then on that side, it's not bad. He got some talent, he did that. Very nice. Let's come out of here. Oh, let's just have a look. Nice. I like those uh, logs, just all the way down the uh, little stream there. Let's have a, see if we have a nice look, that's nice. Anyway, let's have a look at the other side of the bridge. Nice. Right, let's get over this bit here. Ow. That's not supposed to stick there. Right. Okay, so we've got to do get through this muddy patch. Do you know what? I'm not actually even sure I'm allowed down here. Screw it. We're almost at the uh, second bridge, so it's time for a, a joke. What did the hungry clock do? Went back four seconds. Where do these stairs go? They go up. Look at that beauty. Very nice. Right, let's go and have a look around this. I'm not going up those stairs quite yet. I will do though. Just want to have a look. Have a look at this. Let's have a look underneath. Okay, let's do this. I have no idea what's on the uh, top here. But we're gonna find out soon enough. where I've just come from. Just come out of the uh, pathway that I was walking along and uh, I've just found a sign for something very interesting so I'm gonna have to go and search for that. Worth Church, Saxon, 871 to 901. Now, if there's an old Saxon church around here that's probably why we have a Saxon road. It's 
is the Saxon church. It is a Sunday, so I don't know whether they're going to be having a service in there or not. I'm assuming I can just come and have a look. Very peaceful, very lovely place. But check this out. That is one gorgeous church. There you have it, oh my goodness. Look at that. What does it say? Just above the uh, the gate there it says enter into this thus the enter in enter into this gate was Thanksgiving. With Thanksgiving. Um let's have a look at some of the uh Graves. I've got some really nice gravestones around here, so um, let's have a look. This one's for uh, Ronald Henry Smith, Captain Seventh, Gurkha Rifles. Age 22, died on active service, 1945. Well, look, this is a, a strange one, it's just wooden. It's a leaning wooden cross. I just had to free up uh, loads of me uh, memory, delete some stuff so I can actually record this. So I have to be quick, so I don't know how long this is going to last, but this is the inside of St. Nicholas's Church and it is the 11th oldest church in England. In England, I just know that off the top of my head. Um, dun, 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 there's not, there's no information sheets or anything. Um, I just there we go, so that's the back. Apparently those windows up on the right hand side are extremely rare in a church like this. I do love this guy here. It's a uh, cross, but it's not a dying cross, it's a resurrection cross. So I thought that's quite nice. Now this font dates from the 13th century and has a different carving on every side. That's gorgeous, isn't it? And then on the top here, we have presented by a Reverend something something of worth, 1882.